I don't always make series on this channel, but when I do, I go all in. Without further ado, let's dive into my Notion workspace and show you guys how to build a homepage in Notion. So here is my Notion homepage. It's called Workspace, but it's basically my homepage. This is where I have everything here. I have four sections where I basically put the different buckets of my life. You know, I got the schedules and tasks, which is more of the day-to-day -day stuff, the overall rides productive bucket, the goals and ideas, some work stuff. Then I have my little bits at the bottom, which is like the examples of videos. I probably should knock that out somewhere, but I haven't organized it yet. So basically in this series, I'm gonna take you from this to this with hopefully everything filled out that you can and will want to have. So first and foremost, let's get into the sectioning of this. So we wanna keep it bare bones. Let's put a little home at the top, put a little cover, and put whatever image makes you feel good. I'm gonna put the city, I like the city. Boom, all right. Then what we're gonna wanna do here in order to get the sectioning is is before we dive into pages, you know, we, we want to get the organizational part figured out. So I have the four sections in my Notion workspace. It doesn't have to be the same for everybody, but that's what I like to have. So I'm going to show you my example. And the main thing here is you're going to learn how to use the header functions, the different parts of separating headers, getting things organized, and then having a nice little navigation bar at the top that isn't the same as this one. So first and foremost, what we're going to want to do is actually do a slash H2. So if we go slash H2, uh, header two will be set up. So I'm gonna do schedule and tasks, and then we press enter slash DIV and divider will come up. Now we're gonna duplicate this three times. Now we have these set up, so I can do example row, or I can actually, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do projects for what the prize productive one was. I'm gonna do goals and ideas. Then I'm gonna do work. So we wanna take these and drag it all in one block, then move it to the side, just like this. Now you gotta do a little organizing here. Just take it to the side and drag it like this. Take this divider, tuck it in, and then do the same process. So we take these, drag it to the side, tuck this guy in there, and then we have it set up. So then now, so I'm gonna take a block here, and this is a nice little neat trick because some people don't really know how to do this, but if you have yourself in a circumstance where, oops, like this, this area doesn't have a space for me to put a header, you can just take a block in an empty space and just drag this to the top. And then you have a space, or you can press enter from the top, but I just like being extra. So here, what I usually have is a Notion synced block that is organized in a way that has most of my schedule and tasks and projects that I'm primarily used. So if we go back to my actual homepage, you will see this is comprised of a synced block that has a bunch of, I believe, H3 emojis. Like it's, it's a bunch of H3s. And basically what these are is they're emojis with hyperlinks to different pages. So let's go back to the Notion homepage. We got schedules and tasks here. I'm gonna give an example of this, I'm gonna do slash page, daily planner. We will not be diving into this today, but I just wanted to give some examples, right? So we go to, I'm actually give a space here or two. Let's go task, calendar, wait, it's page, task, calendar. All right, so we wanna make sure by the way that these are tucked in. So we wanna make sure if you drag these right here, they stay tucked in there. So I'm gonna do a little H3, or actually I think it's H2s. We look at sizing, so we go emoji, so we do a little this and then type home, we can get an emoji. So when I click the three dots here, press copy link, hover over that, control V, and then boom. What do we have here? We have this as a hyperlink, so if I went to another page, I'll show you in a second, but so you can see it's about the same size, just wanted to make sure. So we can right, or click on the three dots here, hit turn into synced block. So now that anywhere that this will go, we can paste this. So for example, onto, we copy this, we or copy and sync, go to the daily planner and paste this at the top. And what do we have? 
It's a nice little navigation bar so that you can go from page to page and have it all be interconnected. So that's step one, we built your Notion homepage. And now that you have this framework built out, we can then kind of build upon it. And in each step from here, we're going to go into the different parts in your Notion workspace and you will see how it gets built out and it'll go from something like this to something like this. And with that being said, I will see you guys in the next one.